Hey, what up, boys? It's Tenebs and Girls. This is your new time to be welcome back to another reaction video. And today, we're going to be reacting to Blue Lock. And if you guys have, I'm, I'm pretty sure most of you guys already know this already, but I am a footballer, or I guess for you Americans, um, soccer player. <laughs> and yeah, I'm usually a very versatile player. I like to go to the winger, but at the same time, I think my most preferred position is the center defensive midfield. But yeah, in case this is just gibberish to you, people who don't really play and who only watch Blue Lock, then, uh, uh, welcome! This is probably like the safe haven where I can kind of like, I guess I would try my best to like explain the techniques. Like when they explain stuff, I guess I'll talk about that, see how accurate it is. And I think Blue Lock, it takes place after the 2018 World Cup where Japan got famously knocked out by Belgium, which is probably the best comeback in all of international history. Pretty sure, like I wasn't a Japanese, I'm not a, what? What the fuck? I'm not a Japanese person. But when I watched that and I saw Japan lose at the final minute, I felt hurt. Like, I was... I was broken. And I'm not even Japanese, so imagine how Japanese people think about that and how they're going to add that into an anime. That's a pretty good concept. So I am very excited to watch this. I wonder how they're going to um, portray it, especially since the World Cup is starting out. It's gonna start in like another few months. So yeah, I'm, uh, I'm excited to see how this goes. So yeah, without further ado, let's just jump into it. Oh, is this our main character? Oh, okay, nice nutmeg, all right. Okay, come on. Damn, okay, Messi. <laughs> oh, are you going to pass or are you going to take the Ronaldo route? Oh, it says soccer, ah, oh, whatever. Nice. How? How do you miss? Huh? Hey, okay. That's trash. Oh, and look at that. Wow, what a counterattack! Damn. Okay. Wow, that is tr yo. You guys gotta, you guys, you guys gotta kick that guy out. Ah, uh, I mean, that's pretty bad. Whoa! You're no one. Oh, damn. Oh, okay, so they they have made up players. Okay. Okay, all might. Ah. Uh, oh, what a situation. Yo. Holy shit, the aura is insane. Oh. Damn. Damn. I like that raw emotion. This is the most decorated place in all of football history. <laughs> There's one thing Japanese needs to become the best in the world. The birth of a revolutionary striker. Does this take place? Does this really take place after the Belgium beatdown? Because if it is, I don't think the striker is your most problematic position. I don't know, I'm just saying, conceding, conceding three goals in the span of like 30 minutes, then the defense is the problem. Oh, yeah? Okay. It's about scoring more goals than that's true. I'm uh, I'm gonna keep listening because obviously there's definitely more to it. So, uh, no, no, is Noah like? Is it like Thierry Henry? Is that what he's supposed to be or something? Or is it Dan? He's a <laughs> what? Okay, okay. Oh, Kantana, alright. He did say that. Yeah, well, Pele, okay. Alright, go on. Okay. I think I kind of get it. I get it. Like it is true that like some uh, some players are good because of their 
egos, I guess, Cristiano Ronaldo being one of them, he always says that he is the best. But, you know, there are also players like Messi, who is the most humble person ever, and he is arguably one, like, top two, you know, because I don't want to get into debate over Messi versus Ronaldo. I guess it's not, I, I guess I can see his point, but it, it isn't something I entirely agree on, but we'll have to see. Jesus Christ, this is epic. <laughs> it isn't true though. Um, literally the best player of the year in this year is a striker that a very selfless player, Karim Benzema won. So, I don't know how that plays into the role of this anime. Like the logic of this anime at least. Damn. Yeah, it is that competitive. Whoever struck by the ball is it. Oh, uh, is this chicken in the middle? Oh! What? The that is! This is an MMA? What the flip? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, yo. Holy sh- Alright. Oh my god. That's some shot power. Jeez! Oh. There's no such thing right now. Oh, yo. That's sad. Oh shoot! All right. Oh! Oh, he took it. Oh my gosh! This is crazy! What the f? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> what is this? Yo! That is sick. Oh, good volley! Damn! Yo! You did my boy wrong. Wow. <laughs> what the heck? That is crazy. This enemy is this enemy is nuts. No, Bajiro. Uh huh? Damn, where'd you get that line? Hot topic? What is this? What am I watching? That's so sick! Jeez. What? This is JoJo! <laughs> Honestly, I like it. <laughs> Who is Noel Noah? <laughs> that guy does not exist. Am I crazy? This, no, there's no way that guy exists. I don't believe it. I, I don't believe it. Yeah, no. What? It Wait, huh? Noah Lang. No, yeah, no, that's not the same person. Okay, so it is a completely made-up player. Uh, alright. That makes sense. Hmm. What is this uniform? Where's this like, place? 2078? Real? Did he say Real Madrid? Then change your nationality? That's a... That's an option. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why does Neymar look like that? What? <laughs> what? Yo, Neymar turned 50! To top him, new tactics are born. Damn, that kind of goes. That kind of goes against it. All right, I'll talk about it later. Oh, yeah, he's going to. S All right, so he is a Real Madrid player. All right, uh, is this the ending? It is the ending. That was my reaction of Blue Lock. What? <laughs> so I think this is pretty entertaining in terms of uh, fantasy, though. I don't see like obviously this isn't. You know, this isn't real, and obviously this isn't supposed to be real. But I do understand like the logic behind it. Um, you know, having there, w it would be 
um it would be good if japan had or if any country has like that one player who was just very egotistical um say ronaldo or um let's see who else uh who else i can think of i guess well at the moment there's only ronaldo who is at that top level uh who is just very very egotistic but despite you know despite ronaldo being egotistic he is still a very team player that's something that people overlook that people just think that he is arrogant and cocky but he is also a team he also passes a lot and he also uh is a team player overall you know i i like this i like this in terms of um i like this in terms of the uh entertainment value but in terms of the uh message it shows like you know one of the one of the things it's like it says that uh because of this one player we are going to change strategy just to fit this superstar that's that's just wrong in terms of you know well football because football players are ne- no no there's always the players are never no player is bigger than a team so that's that's the mindset that has been given and that is the mindset that has been given in the world in here too but they're trying to challenge that mentality and I am interested to see how that goes. So what do you guys think? Do you guys find this entertaining? Do you guys want me to watch the next Blue Lock episodes? I don't know if I would, but if if you guys really want to, I will continue and I'll see how fucking crazy this shit goes. But um, yeah, uh, I don't think I have anything else to say, so I'm going to leave this video here. If you guys are new to the channel, like you guys enjoyed the Blue Lock, and if you also subscribe to Sweet Desert Blues, and comment below because your support is welcome. And yeah, I guess that's it. Peace!